This is the result of this free A tool that add animation to images. You can use reference video to animate and even generate animation by just using prompts, but it's a bit complicated. Watch it very carefully because even if you're able to generate the animation, you won't be able to find the result. Make sure to watch it till the very end. Now let's see which AI tool we'll be using. Just go on your browser and search for Viggle AI. This is the website, it's currently in beta, that's why I think it's free. Well, that's good for us. It gives us two options, join beta in web and join beta in discord. Both have their advantages and disadvantages. If you don't want to go to Discord and want hassle-free interface, go with web. But remember on peak hour, it will only give you free generation and also results won't be as good as Discord. Now, what would I recommend? I will say go with Discord because it have lots of channel to generate from. If one channel is busy, then go with another. If that's busy, go with another. So it's good. And also I think Discord generates slightly better result. Now just click on join beta in Discord. But before clicking on that, make sure you have installed Discord and logged in and clicking on that it will ask you to accept invitation just accept it then it will take you to Discord and this is where you'll land now move your cursor to left and scroll down you see all of these these are all channels where you can generate animated videos now which one to choose from I would recommend don't go with first except that you can go with any channel because first one have lots of people continuously generating images let's go with animate 14 now this is what you'll see lots of people generating their animation now scroll down and get to the bottom. Now we need images to work with, so just go back to Chrome browser, then on new tab search for Lexica Art, you'll find lots of images generated by other people, so just go on search bar and search for 3D character. And if you want custom character, then you can also generate that. Now as you can see, there is lots of character to choose from. I'll go with this one. Now just click on download icon and download it. Now let's get back to Discord. Now just type slash and these option will pop up. Don't feel astonished. These are the only two options that we have to focus on, animate and mix. In animate, you have to provide image that you want to animate and add prompt about how you want to move your character and other not so important stuff that we'll see when we'll be generating. Now, in mix, you also have to provide image that you want to animate and provide reference video that you want your character to move like. For now, let's start with animate. Just click on animate. Now upload the image of your character. Now click on prompt. Either you can write, which you and I are not good at, so we'll go back to Viggle.ai. Now let's add slash prompt to its O. Now there are lots of prompts to choose from and the best part is it have all the trending TikTok and Instagram reel, dance and movements. You can choose anything, but for this video I am going with. So I'll search for Hugo and I'll just copy the first one. Now let's just go back to Discord, paste it. Now for the background, it will give you three option, white, green and template. White means white. And if you want to add your character to a specific place, then go with green. But if you want same as prompt video, then go with template. So I'll just click on template. Now just select on for the fine tune and hit enter. Now our message has been sent. And now comes the tricky part. Sometimes it takes more than two to three minutes to give you your generated videos. But most of the time it will give you in one minute or less. But because so many people are constantly generating, it's hard to find your videos. So how you'll find your videos, if you have noticed in my generating request, my username was hidden because I am on streamer mode right now because I'm screen recording. So when you record your screen, Discord will automatically tune it on your on streamer mode to protect your privacy, which you can turn that off just by clicking of disable streamer mode. Now our username is visible, just copy it. Now go on the search bar and select mention and paste your username and you will find all the animation generated by you. And this is the result of our generation. And this is how you can use this in memes. Now let's see how to generate using reference, type slash and select mix. Now it will ask you for your character image and reference video. For image, I'm using this one. 
and for reference video I'm using this one. Now just turn on the fine tune and hit enter. And this is the result. Now this is all there is to know and subscribe if you think this video has provided you any value. Okay, then take care. See you tomorrow.